Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I welcome you today. You are my brothers, my sisters. Thank you so much. Thank you to all the new subscribers. If you're new to my channel, I ask you to take that manly coat off and come as a spiritual being because that's what you are. I got some good food for you today. Some really good food. I really thank you. Yeah, always put in some great, great uh, affirmation. Uh, megahertz music like the one I got. And man, this stuff is great for healing and great for stress. Great to bring you happiness. Today's topic, Great Awakening 2020. Happiness is the key to everything good. Age of Aquarius per your law of attraction. Great Awakening 2020. Happiness is the key to everything good per your law of attraction per your age of Aquarius. Guys, I want you to do uh, what I need you to do. Uh, if you'd like, you can feel this music. Go in and shut your eyes and go in and listen. I'm going to give you some great stuff because this music here will soothe you. Happiness is uh, the key to a lot of things. Uh, there's a guy named Bruce Lipton. He said if you're happy all the time, that's 90% healing process to all sickness. You're never sick. So today, guys, I want you to read Psalms, first chapter, 1 through 3. Psalms, first chapter, 1 through 3. God himself is telling you, to always stay happy in that verse. Stay away from the scoffers, which is your media, who mocks people, makes fun of them. Stay away from your sinners. And then if you do, you'll be like the tree by the water and always plant and always good fruits will come in your harvest. Please read that for yourself. I did a test this morning just to see. I listened to some great, like I was in a great spirit, and just for five minutes, I went on YouTube to listen to uh, CNN. That quick in five minutes, my thoughts changed from very good to very bad. No matter what they, all the topics, it was, I could not find anything good. So once again, please do what Psalms, first chapter one through three says. Uh, media tells you nothing about being happy, nothing about healing, nothing about God, nothing about joy. It talks about people. It deceives you. It tells lies. It does everything away from the law of God. Proverbs 23 says, what you think, as a man thinketh in the heart, so is he. So, you are your own television program by which you're programming your subconscious brain. I still don't get it. Why do people listen to the news? You say you obey the law of God, then why do you watch the news that does nothing for you towards the law of God? It promotes fear, hate, and then you're programming that into your subconscious brain. Then you don't feel good after you turn that TV off. But imagine if you put some music in like the one I got and you just thought of all the good things you had. Because that's what uh, God wants. And if you shut your eyes right now and listen to the music. think of all the good things you have that's what I do daily think of your great wonderful family you have think of your job you have the goodness the good things about the job think about your beautiful husband or wife you have 
Happiness is the key to great, successful life. If you were to attract something, which would uh, think if you're always happy what you attract? So that's why God, the universe of God, always wants us happy. Before this war, this is the type of affirmations I was doing. But uh, God told me everything is okay. He's taking care of everything. So I went back to a peaceful and loving affirmation, which is this one now, which is happiness. Guys, I want you to look up another thing, silver. Did you know silver is great for healing? Yeah, silver. Uh, it does great for the skin, but also there's a drink. There's a silver drink out. You can Google, you can YouTube it for a little bit more information on it. It's great for viruses and diseases. It's a silver drink out. And uh, it's great for viruses and diseases. When you have a chance, look up the powers of the healing of silver. Like I told you, Dr. Fauci has nothing on what I can teach because my, my knowledge comes from the universe of God. He already had natural stuff here to heal us that has no side effects. Listen to that music. Man, yeah, just shut your eyes, man, and listen to the great melody of that music. Think of all the good things you have. Yesterday is gone. Let yesterday go. You can't fix yesterday. You can fix today. You can only fix the future. You can't fix the past. You can start right now. Become that new man or new woman right now. Change your life and take control of your life. Just think of all the things of happiness. Shut your eyes. Every day is a beautiful day. Say it and believe it, and it becomes existing. You are the creator of your life. Take control back from man and start controlling your life how you want it to be. Satan works through man to work through us. I beg of you, stop listening to media. Take control back from your life and plant the seeds of what you want in your life and they will come to a harvest. That's all through your law of God in the books. I really appreciate you guys. Each morning I listen to this music, this type of music. When I go to sleep, I listen to this type of music and it gives me an overwhelming peace of, peace of mind and, and nothing but joy and happiness. I no longer watch the news in the morning. Sometimes I may look to give a topic to you guys to see what's going on and, and uh, interpret it through the law of, uh, law of the universe to see what he says about it. But other than that, it does nothing good for you. You become your own television program by what you tune into and you plant in your subconscious brain. 
That's why it's called television programs, because they program you. But if you simply turn that off, now you take control. Think of everything happy. Television will not have you happy when you finish with the news. Think of all the abundance in your life. You got food in your ice box. Great health. Happiness is everything. It's a key to everything great. Better man, better woman, always be happy. Then you are going to attract a happy man, happy woman. What you give out, you get back. Man, close your eyes and think of all the great things you have. Take that deep breath. This is the way God wants us every day. This is how we take back the world with our high frequency, which is your spiritual being. Thinking peace, love, joy, happiness. Get rid of your hatred. That's the man making you hate. But in your spiritual being, the outer body shell that is gone. Let those weights go of the world. Love everybody. God himself through the reap with your soul law will take care of anything bad that's happened to you. You are a child of the universal God. No worries. Universal God led on my heart to do one of happiness. Many times we don't take time to just take a day of being happy. Sometimes be selfish to yourself to improve the world because if you're thinking happiness, what do you think is going to track back to you? All happiness. Your signal of energy, you are a signal of energy. And whatever you broadcast out, that's what comes to you. So if you're always fearful, you're going to see nothing but fear. But if you see no fear, no worries, you won't see any fear or worry. So anything that's talking about fear and worry, tune it out, cut it off. God gave us the power through him to do all things if we only believe through our faith. Life is great. You just simply believe it. And you start to program it in your subconscious brain and it becomes fact. Guys, I appreciate you. I'm going to go about three minutes of silence and let this affirmation play. You guys take care. I really appreciate you. Once again, I'm going to go in silence for about three to four minutes and let this play and then I'll cut it off.